generation, as you can see, Madonna. But unfortunately for my son, I do anything. What do you think Madonna would think of Yeet? I am not sure. Have I you don't ever, know. Have you ever listened to Yeet's music? You know what? Not really. But before concert, we started, and it's absolutely incredible. Oh. <laughs> What do you like about Yeet? Fuck, he's a, he's a charismatic dude. He makes good music. He's just so uplifting, you know? He brings me joy to my life, you know? There's nothing bad about the guy. He, he could, like, do anything. He could fucking shoot this kid right here. I would not give a fuck, bro. It's Yeet. I would love it. I'd love to die that, that way. But yeah, we all came from the UK uh, to New York to see it just for a couple of days. And it was an impulsive decision. And then what we always wanted to come see Yeet. She was like, you know, you need to get to traveling, coming to see New York. New York is amazing. And look, now we're here. And I'm excited. You, you talked about Yeet or something, like the history of Yeet, I think. I did, I did make a video about that. Yeah, I've seen your videos before. That's it. Last year, I went to a Yeet show to find out why he was so popular. He was one of the hottest new rappers in years. And his first tour would be our first chance to witness his terminally online fan base translate to real life. Bro, he's just the GOAT. Like, it's Yee. Like, who else is fucking with Yee here, bro? Like, who else is getting, like, eight, like, a million followers in, like, a month? That clip went viral and came to define Yeet fandom in a lot of people's heads. Even Yeet saw the video. He didn't seem to care for it. But Yeet's bigger now. He plays festivals. He has one of the biggest rap albums of the year. He's evolved. Surely his fan base has, too. Only way I could find out was to get back in the trenches. We're at the Yeet show. We're at the Yeet show, Terminal 5, part two. Talking to Yeet fans, let's go. Oh, you guys are the first ones here? Yes, sir. Yeah, bro. We're here at 12 o'clock. Bro, we went and grabbed we some got coffee. coffee like three times. <laughs> Had to take a shit, took a shit at five guys. Got the burgers and we came right online, 12 o'clock. Yeah, bro. I got here at like 12 and everyone came around like 1, 1 30. I was the first one here. Some people were trying to cut the line, but me and me and these people took care of them. Why are you such a big fan of Yeet? He's just really cute and like his music, his music makes me like hype, like you know like, woo! What do you think makes him cute? He's like cute in like a cute way, like he's kind of chubby but like still cute. Like he's like a bear, like a bear basically. The Cardi or Yeet? Cardi or Yeet? Yeet bro, I got a six hour playlist, you want to see that shit? I got Yeet is Christ bro, it's ready, it's ready. Have you ever listened to all six hours in one stretch? Yes, I have. I have. Yeah. Yeah. How do you does? Stubbing and makes me speed is yeah, cause I love it. Yeah. 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 I don't know the words to this part, but like, ah. Good effort. Wow. Yeah. Once he first blew up in like 2020, it changed my music taste forever. And then when a uh, whole lot of red came out, that also changed my music taste forever. What were you listening to before Yeet? Before Yeet? I don't know, probably like some soft shit like Tyler the Creator, um, Boy Pablo, lots, lots of those, but no, kind of switched up. So. We're at the Yeet show. Yeah, a lot of people, big line. What happened to Yeet? Uh, he's really famous now, really rich. I've been thinking about him since the last album. It's, I don't think he has any emotions. It's all just uh, like technical stuff. Like, he, does he love anyone? Does he have any pain? Does he, is he curious about the world? I don't think so. What do you all like about Yeet? His voice is different. And like, whoa, for sure. People hated it at first, I think, right? They were, they were making fun of him, but like, he's good, so. Do you think that's how his voice actually sounds? Like yes. This. But and we watched all the videos before yeah. we came. He sounds like practically the same. His Maybe earlier not music, for as long. His though. earlier music is different, the way he sounds, but like, oh, yeah, I think he sure. just grew up. So. Grew up? Yeah, his voice sounds like he's older now. What I like about Yeet, he's not like other people, you know? And uh, I think there's only, well, I would say a small group needs to people know how Yeet is, you know? Because not everybody's into his music. And you need to have the same mindset, in my opinion. Do you like his music back home? Do people like his music back home? Yes, no, yeah, indeed. Uh, even in the UK. Uh, but not so familiar as in America. But yes, in the UK, people do know who Yeet is. I'm old generation, as you can see, Madonna. But unfortunately for my son, I do anything. What do you think Madonna would think of Yeet? I am not sure. 
Have, I you, ever, know. have you ever listened to Yeats music? You know what? Not really, but before concert we started and it's absolutely incredible. <laughs> I, it just came to me in a dream, you know what I mean? I had a vision about one of the most lyrical rappers of our generation and, and then the next day I heard a Yeats song. I'm working on dying. If you could tell Yeats something, what would you tell him? Thank you for I being you. our goat. Burp. Thank Burp. you. Burp. Yeah. Tell him. Shmunko. 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 Man. Man. I'm working on he's, he's my inspiration. Deep down. Yeah. I love him. Are we here with? Uh, I'm the Kool-Aid man. You think you like Kool-Aid? Uh, definitely. What inspired you to wear this study to this to this event? Uh, I like Kool-Aid. Quite a bit. How often do you drink Kool-Aid? Enough. Like often. Are you excited for tonight? Of course. What are you gonna do inside? You gonna drink Kool-Aid? If there's Kool-Aid, 